sand sharks or so. <laughs> they're a little scary, but they're mostly just funny because they're like, rah, rah, rah. <laughs> I don't know. Kind of cute, honestly. If they weren't, if they weren't trying to eat me, that is. Nope. The stalkers are not cute. Ooh, this is where we get to the deep parts. Um, not like. Show a nearby cave entrance. Yeah, I see it. Meters, leading to an unknown environmental biome. Ooh, 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 yes. Three facts. These guys are so cool. Is that? Hold on. Is that a baby reef bag? It's so small. Most of them are huge. Hello? It's like, like, comparatively small. This one's... Like, look. See this one? I'm pretty sure it's some kind of... It's making the full-grown adult sound, but like... Yeah, over here we got... Aha! That does not look correct. Yeah, there we go. Oh! Is that like a small... Viper! Yep, it, it, it is definitely a Viper. That is an accurate name. 30 seconds. on them. That's cool. Integrating new PDA data. Is that it? Just PDA data? Ooh, ooh. No, this is a Seamoth fragment. That's very good. I wouldn't have noticed that. Oh shit, the Seaglide's almost out of power. Do you have anything in here that we could look at or scan or... No? Okay, we'll come back to it. Oh, 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 oh. It's gonna... Not going to be useful immediately right now, but it will be important later. Integrating new PDA data. Yes, battery charge, battery charger. We need that. Desperately need that. Okay. Oxygen. Yep. I am aware. We're cutting it close here. Oh, that was too close. Well, fuck. <laughs> I was paying close attention to the time, but not the power on the sea glide. So it might be a little bit of a long trek back. picked up a massive debris field at your location. I didn't know how bad, how many of you, I, I didn't know. We're now en route to your location. We're gonna bring you home. Sunbeam out. What else can I say? The only time I parked a rig this big on a rock that small was in VR. And I blew it. It's a bad option, all right, but so are all the others. Well, let's check. What do we need for the habitat builder? We need a computer chip, wiring kit, and a battery. We can make a wiring kit now. Computer chip. We need another cable drawn to close. Yeah, we could. We could absolutely do this. Like right now. Copper, we can 
probably have some grip now. We can get it pretty soon. Copper, copper, copper. Do we have copper? We do not. Copper, sweet. Yeah. And yes. Near blueprint acquired. Now we just need a battery. Which we can get from Right. Uh we need more copper. Damn it. <laughs> Oh no. to construct habitats capable of withstanding extreme environmental conditions. Vital signs stabilizing. Okay, sweet. We have the habitat builder now. Three, let me show you what I can do. I need blood. Do I have any? Uh, you do not. Okay. Lead. That's good. Copper. That's something we need. is loss of orientation, followed by eventual asphyxiation. Thanks. This is Life Pod 6. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Request immediate assistance. Six out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. Alright, anyway, we should be able to make a foundation now for the habitat. So let's, let's set that down. Oh, hang on, we don't. But I cannot see. It's too dark. Should be fine. Yeah, we still need a bit of lead.
Sunbeam? You know Aurora. We're from a little transgov on the far side of Andromeda, and we have a saying there. There's no bad without the good, no good without the bad. Sounds like you tasted a bunch of the former, but that only means you're overdue a whole lot of the latter. Might just be we're in. We're scanning for somewhere to park. We'll be in touch when we find it. Sunbeam out. Oh yeah, we're getting ramp plus. Probably not as close as it looks because the ship's pretty huge, but closer. Oh yeah. Supply crate. Ooh, power cell. Nice. Cell salvage, don't want that. That. What is going on here? I can't see. Oh no. What? What is that? No. No, thank you. So big. Life form readings in this region are sparse. The Aurora's radioactive fallout will have devastating effects on the alien ecosystem if not contained within the next 24 hours. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Oh, God. Self-scan complete. Foreign bacteria count has reached statistically significant levels. No adverse effects detected. Be vigilant for symptoms. Yep. You're infected, I guess. What? No idea. But it's something. site for you that's well it's better than the alternatives we've sent you the coordinates it'll take us a couple of days to align our orbit we should be able to establish direct contact with you during that time then we're coming in to get you cross your fingers the weather rolls don't leave us waiting sunbeam out <laughs> <laughs> 